New developments now surrounding a man found guilty of battering a law enforcement officer in Orlando. His attorneys are now set to speak out and call for a new trial. Noel Carter's story made national headlines because of this video showing two Orlando police officers kicking and using a taser on Carter outside a downtown club. News 6 reporter Sashel Saunders is live at the Orange County Courthouse this morning. And Sashel, those officers were cleared, but Carter's attorneys are also calling for a Department of Justice investigation. Yeah, uh, Bridget and Justin, that's what they want because they say that the Orlando Police Department has an excessive force problem and their client's case highlights that. We are uh, very disappointed in the verdict. Lawyers for Noel Carter say their client is not guilty of battering Orlando officers and resisting arrest. Instead, they say he is the victim. Obviously, the video shows how much they abused him and beat him on that curb. It's, it's very troubling to us. In a press release, they questioned the, quote, majority white jury that convicted him, mentioned OPD's problem with excessive force in general, and the conversation nationally surrounding policing and de-escalation tactics. I think the evidence in this case was clear that they never even inquired for Mr. Carter what his name was or any of the facts, and that kind of led to, you know, the entire situation. They're now calling for a federal investigation of OPD by the Department of Justice and want the officers involved fired. They say Carter may never recover professionally from his interaction that night with police. This is something that could ruin Mr. Carter's life. Carter will have sentencing next month. His lawyers, as well as those civil rights groups, will have a conference today at 2 o'clock here at the Orange County Courthouse. We'll have more on that conference on News 6 later today.